Well, I'd like to demonstrate how you might go about bringing an AutoCAD drawing into the GCAD Plus environment. I've downloaded and installed the ODA file converter. I've made my input folder C backslash DWG and my output folder DWG. I've put the AutoCAD drawing from an architectural practice into that DWG folder. I've set the input files to be .dwg or even .txf. Not sure if we can just limit it to .txf. Let's see. And we can. And we can change to .dwg. So now I'm set. It's going to take the .dwg file and it's going to output it as a binary .dxf. We have a number of choices here. We can go AutoCAD 2018, 13, 10. I find 2007 is a good starting point. If you don't get something to convert across properly, you might want to up that a bit. So let's start. And we're also auditing the drawing as it comes across. That's all. That's done. Very simple. Then start GCAD Plus and go file and open and change your files of type down here to DXF and there it is the output file and open it up this is a big drawing so it will take a little while but all of this information from the architect is going to come across and here we are we're looking here at one of the layouts here's another layout and I'm working my way across them and if we go into the model and let's zoom out just a little you can see here we are all sorts of information the survey information contours and so on are all uh, on separate layers if we go into the layers we've got an awful lot of layers that aren't being used this is not GCAD Plus's problem this is the problem problems being generated by the architectural firm. It's a good idea to check that all layers are in fact on. This could become quite a nightmare. There is a layer called demo. Obviously it's the demolition for the site which you might leave turned off because it's being done. So that's all there is to it. You just put the incoming file into a folder, set your ODA file converter which is a free application and then turn it into a DXF binary file format which will load into GCAD Plus very quickly. Let's just zoom the window and check it and it's very 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 quick. So that's how to handle DWG files.